Well, today the Cal Ripken Senior Foundation broke ground on a new youth playground where Home Plate once stood at Memorial Stadium. This is the first of several parks that are planned for Baltimore City. 11 Sports' Pete Gilbert joins us live in the studio now to explain. Pete, that's great news. Yeah, you know, the destruction of Memorial Stadium left more than a few heartbroken in Baltimore. So many memories trashed by a wrecking ball. But after nine years, Baltimore's baseball royalty, the Ripkins, has found a way to fill the void and provide for kids in the city. A perfect combination that broke ground today. Opening day. It once stood as a showcase of civic pride, Memorial Stadium. Baltimore's home for champions from 1950 till its unceremonious demise in 2001. And now East 33rd Street once again will hear baseball's cheers. One, two, three. The Cal Ripken Senior Foundation spearheaded a fundraising effort that garnered $1.5 million. The result delivers the flagship Youth Baseball Park Center, one that can also accommodate a football game on the very spot where the Orioles and Colts once gave us memories of a lifetime. And this site right here, uh, it, it, when this site became available, it was a no-brainer. It was a thought that said, this is uh, what it's supposed to be, this is what it was meant to be. The Central Y of Maryland will own and operate the park while the Ripken Senior Foundation runs the youth programs on site. Ripken Baseball has long held grasp on the kids' movement, but unlike the Cal Ripken World Series in Aberdeen, the level of play means far less simply than the accessibility. We're not trying to build Major League Baseball players or National Football League players at this site of Memorial Stadium. We're trying to give kids a chance. Look down at what we're sitting on right now. This is a lot of the fields around this area that kids have to go play on. Uh, I wouldn't want to come here and play on this. A state-of-the-art synthetic surface guarantees a long shelf life. It will look pristine in 10 years. It will look fantastic in 20 years. And I think that's all important uh, uh, part of it is it's got to continue to look uh, good and new, and it's got to attract kids to want to play on it. Honoring thy father, the Ripkins take this old-fashioned sentiment farther than most. His legacy um, was about helping and uh, helping kids uh, and using baseball to get in front of them and talk to them. And so Billy and I certainly uh, thought that was important to capture that spirit. Have won the Cal Ripken World Series Championship. Now many, of course, wondering if Cal Ripken Jr. will rebuild the Orioles themselves as he transcends the ghosts of Memorial Stadium. I sat down with the Iron Man today and we'll discuss his future with the O's coming up new at 6. Live in the studio, Pete Gilbert, WBA.